I said no to an old high school friend's wedding because she always gave me nightmares. Hi, I'm a 23-year-old woman, and one day I received a text from my 24-year-old high school friend Susie to ask me about her wedding. I was driving at the moment, so I couldn't read her message. Later that day, when I arrived home and checked my phone, I saw her message saying, Should I invite you to my wedding? And I immediately replied no, without thinking twice, as I knew I won't be able to attend because I have other things to do. Susie and I met in high school. We started our classes together and due to mutual friendship and living close to each other, it didn't took long for us to become best friends. Plus, we also had so many things in common. We used to hang out very often, but sometimes, when we are meeting with other people or going out with our other friends, Susie just ghosted me like I'm nobody, and when I asked her about anything, she ignored me with no reply. This confused me a lot about our friendship. The last time we spoke to each other was in junior year, when she told everyone how I tried to hit her with my car. This scared me a lot as I don't remember doing anything like that. I literally started having nightmares about me killing someone by force of being murdered. My memory became like a broken glass, and I even started questioning myself, maybe they are right, and I did that. But that's not all. Susie also tried to fight me in the hall in front of everyone and embarrassed me. Her other friends who believed her and listened to her also started treating me like a psycho or trash bin. Everyone distanced themselves from me. Nobody sat with me in class or go out with me like I'm gonna infect them with some virus. I finished the high school all alone and a year later. I tried to contact another friend of mine who lived with Susie and asked her to hang out. She made me talk with Susie who cried in tears and started to apologize about everything she did to me. She said, I'm sorry about that hitting me with car thing. I really thought you were about to hit me. She apologized about everything, but I still couldn't get over the nightmare so I refused to meet her. And now, almost two years later, I'm still having nightmares about my high school experience. So I said no to her wedding. I made one mistake of saving her invite message in our chat. When she saw me reply, she responded with, if you don't want to come to my wedding, then why save the message? You all weirdos are the same. I think she was referring to my other high school friend that I'm in contact with. I tried to call her later to explain I didn't meant any disrespect by saying no. I just don't have time to come. But she didn't answer my call. It's been three days now, and she has ghosted me again. I clearly understand that would have upset her. But did I do anything wrong by saying no, or should I accept her her invitation and go to her wedding. Please let me know in comments.